just the thought of batch editing a bunch of channels i think this is incredible so let's get into all the possibilities that you can do with this i'm gonna press and hold on the mute button and i get this page from here you can hold on input and all the input channels will get linked and i can just press this and now all my channels are muted 1 to 8 9 to 16 17 to 24 25 to 32 but everything else is unmuted i can do the same for the aux for the effects returns buses matrices main dcas if you don't want everything you can just click on the link button and it will just mute those channels that you linked and by the way this is just a temporary link that will go away as soon as you close that page it's not like the quick gang that you have inside the channel right here just in case you haven't seen that before if you do quick gang channels one two three for example and scope is these things and apply i can go into the eq and do a move like this and if i go to the other channels they will have the same eq so this is grabbing the same parameter on all the channels that are linked and moving it at the same time i'm not talking about this first good thing about this batch edit it's that it's temporary it gets turned off as soon as you close the page second good thing is it works on literally everything not just mute not just solo you can do that for the gain of the channels even though this is not a button and if i click and hold on it nothing will happen i can double click on the knob to open the slider view and you see right here there's this layers icon if i click on it you have all these so if you have drum microphones for example channels one to six you can link those together and move them all at the same time proportionally this is incredible Polarity switches. I can also invert the polarity on a bunch of channels together at the same time. Link. This is a huge deal. You can really quickly go and link multiple channels together like this from this page all at the same time. Or you can link a bunch of ones and just click next the on off button of the compressor eq and gate you can hold and click on it and then let's link these drum channels and i can turn on and off the eq on all the drum channels at the same time to see if i'm actually improving the sound or making it worse this is incredible if you're practicing mixing you just want to a b before and after and by the way if you don't know that already you can click and hold and swipe to do things on a lot of channels at the same time you don't have to click each one of them okay you can hold and press and swipe so that's turning off and on compressor or eq or gate you can also go into each one of those and grab the attack for example and click on this layers button and here you will have all the attacks combined for the channels that you link together if i move this you will see all of them moving at the same time you can turn on the key for the side chain also so just go around and and press and hold and try things let's say i want to put a low pass filter on 10 channels together at the same time i can go into the filters press and hold on it press and hold and drag to turn on the filter on all these channels then i can go back click on the low cut to open the slider and click on these layers buttons again and link all of these 10 channels together and do the low cut to all of them at the same time you can do the same for eq bands frequency knob you can double click on it and change the same band for a lot of channels at the same time also the q and the gain compressor ratio threshold so also again if you have drums and your drummer is hitting super hard and smashing into the compressor super hard you can open the compressor threshold and go into these layers and batch edit the threshold for all the drum channels so you can raise it so it's not clamping down on the signal as much and the good thing about this is that you don't have to turn it off again the channel gang you have to remember to turn it off but this no problem you want to turn auto time on all the compressors click and hold and click and hold and swipe turn the auto time on all the compressors this is just blowing my mind sends you can click and hold on the on button and turn channels on in a certain bus or turn them off now you can do this in the bus assignment page so that wasn't a huge deal to me however what is a huge deal is in the main section you can now press and hold on the main left right button and unassign a bunch of channels from the main left right so again drums if i want to put them in a subgroup I would go to the sends and I will hold on that on button and turn them on in that bus then go to the main and hold on the left right button and turn them off from the main left right all together before that there wasn't an option to turn a bunch of channels off from the main left right you had to go to each channel and turn this button off the amount of efficiency and flexibility and time saving it adds to your workflow i'm so grateful to the developer of mixing station that he keeps developing it mixing station is worth every single penny it's literally the cost of a sandwich that you will eat and get hungry after a few hours it's so cheap and it's so incredible.